Black-eyed people, sometimes called the black-eyed children or Beck, are young people, often children with eyes that are solid black, with no differentiation between the cellera, pupil, or iris, and are occasionally reported to have blue or bluish tinted skin, like that of a corpse, or your local goth kid. Those who report these encounters with them often feel that the children are somehow supernatural and extremely dangerous, though they cannot explain why. Often, they can be seen playing games and singing nursery songs, such as Old Man Long Legs or He Jumped Into a Bramble Bush, in abandoned areas or near deserted areas. Sometimes, the reports talk of them appearing at one's doorstep, usually alone or in a pair. They appear to be unusually confident, yet shy children who avoid the gaze and look down as if to hide their eyes. But speaking with a equity far beyond their apparent age, often using mannerism and speech patterns of an adult. They occasionally possess the voice of an adult as well. They will usually attempt to talk to the victim into allowing them entry into their home, to use a telephone, or be safe from an unspecified danger. Occasionally, when seen outside the home, they will immediately stop their play and stare at you. If possible, even approaching you to ask for a place to stay or try to talk you into giving them a ride home. Often, people begin to agree with their requests against their better judgment, even though the request seems vaguely unsettling, without realizing why it is. Should you discover that their eyes are completely black, the children become very angry and insistent on you complying with their demands. Some people who have encountered a Beck feel that the children may have been using some form of low-level mind control to get them to comply. Experiences involving Beck generally do not explain the cause of the children's eye color or the origins of the children themselves. Some thought to be the spirits of those lost, murdered children. Uh, the Beck are thought to be harbingers or personal doom or ill will embodiments. The encounters frequently emphasize that the children must be voluntarily admitted into a house, kind of like a vampire. And in this way, they are reminiscent of some other urban legends. However, it's unspecified what happens should you comply with their demands, as there are no report of Beck including that happening possibly including death of those who comply. But how would I know? I'm just your narrator. <laughs> Head out, be safe, but if a child with darkened eyes approaches you, feel free to say no and be on of your merry way. For if you do, this weekend may be your last. Happy Spooktacular. <laughs>